In this video, I'm going to go over static global variables in C. So I've already posted a video going over static local variables, but what about static global variables? Let's go over an example here. Here we have a main.c file with a main function, and the main function is using two functions, add one print, that are defined as part of this external library here. It's also using this number variable here. That's a global variable that's also been defined as part of this external library. If we check out the library.h file here, we'll see the two function declarations. We'll also see this variable declaration with the extern keyword. So extern int number is gonna make available the global variable number to other files like main.c that include library.h. Now in our library.c file, we have the actual variable definition itself, where we say int number is equal to zero. And this defines the global variable number. Then we have the two function definitions as well. So we define the add one function to add one to the number and the print function to print the number. So if we save this and we compile this program, we'll get the expected behavior. We'll add one to the number, we'll print it out, we'll add 10 to the number, and we'll print it out. And the main function can actually access the global variable directly. And that's because of this extern keyword here. Because we said extern int number, we're making it available in this main.c file. So we'll save this and we'll do a compilation here. And we'll see we get the expected output. So we get number one and we get number 11. Now what if we use the static keyword when defining the global variable? So here in library.c, if we say static int number, and now we try to compile the program, we'll actually get an error. So when we try to compile the program, we get an error message here that's basically telling us that the symbol number here can't be found. And we get this linker command failed error here. So what's going on here is that a static global variable is a global variable that can only be accessed in the file in which it's defined. So if we took out this extern line here, and if we took out this line here where we're adding 10 to the number, and this line here where we're printing the number, because there's no point to do that after we printed it once already, it'll actually work again. So if we save this here now and do a recompilation and run it, it works fine. So our main.c file here, it can still use the external library. And in our external library here, this static int number variable is still a global variable. It's just that with the static keyword, that global variable can only be used in this one file here. And so that's really the idea there. A static global variable is a variable that can only be used in the file in which it was defined. Check out PortfolioCourses.com, where we'll help you build a portfolio that will impress employers, including courses to help you develop C programming projects.